Once, the famous painter Pablo Picasso was uh, in the mall and he wanted to get something and he was wandering around from shop to shop and a lady saw him and that lady recognized him and she became almost like mad. She's like, Mr. Picasso, is that you? Is that you? Are you the famous painter? And Pablo Picasso said, yeah, that's me. And she said, I'm a big fan. I've been always hearing about it. It's the first time I'm seeing you live in person. Mr. Picasso, uh, sorry to bother you, but I'm a big fan. Can you do a little bit of drawing for me on this piece of paper? And the lady got a small paper and a pencil. And Mr. Picasso said, absolutely, I'll be happy to do that. And he took the paper, he took the pencil, and he scribbled a bit. He just doodled a bit. And he created a beautiful picture in less than a minute, in 30 seconds. And the lady said, Mr. Picasso, this is such a nice painting, such a nice drawing. Thank you so much. I'm going to always keep it in my heart. And she started walking away. And that's the moment Picasso jokingly said, Mr. Ah, dear lady, that's going to be a million dollars. And she said, Mr. Picasso, a million dollars. It took you just 30 seconds to do that. And Picasso said, dear lady, it took me 30 years to do that in 30 seconds. Oftentimes, you look at a genius, you look at somebody who's a powerful leader or a powerful speaker, somebody who has become a master in, of their craft, master in their field, who's got the domain dominance, and you think you're doing it out of luck, or maybe you are fortunate with some skills and talent. Let me tell you something. People who become masters, they become masters in three different stages. Number one, they get the mindset right. They have the mindset. I'm not talking about some positive attitude. I'm talking about the mindset of a master, mindset of a warrior, mindset that is powerful. Second, they actually harness their skill set. For example, people who become powerful speakers, they're not doing it just by watching YouTube videos. By the way, I know you're watching it on YouTube. That's amazing. But people who become great speakers, they practice, they train. As you can see what we do inside our program, uh, you know, people, we make people practice. They take action. It's not theory. It's practical transformation. So skill set, mindset, skill set. And third thing that you require is your dedication and commitment. You don't need 30 years to become a powerful speaker, but definitely you need about, you know, you know, two to three months to make sure that you really hone it down and really transform yourself. And that's when people will come to you and say, my goodness, you give that speech in two minutes so easily because you have been trained, because you have learned exactly how to, how to change yourself. Now you might say, Bishal, I'm sorry I wasted so much time in my life. I've not harnessed my skill set. Let me tell you something. The best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. The second best time is right now. Right now is the time for you to take action. So if you want to become the best of the best, the cream of the crop from the drip from the drop, and if you want to go from the tip to the top in your speaking skills, I can absolutely help you. Call the number that you can see on the screen where we can personally speak with you and find out exactly how to Hello. make you a master of public speaking so that when you go out there in the boardroom, on the large stage or the virtual presentation, you rock the stage every single time. And that's when people will say, oh my God, how do you do that? How do you use your voice so well? How do you speak with such confidence? How do you speak with such body language? How do you speak with such spontaneity? And I can tell you, you can become the Picasso of your communication and I'll be happy to help you. Pichal Sarkar here reminding you that public speaking is not about perfection. It's all about connection. Like that you will, you will have a journey of uh, around 50 to 70 speeches and, <laughs> yes. and you think uh, you can think about it uh, see in, my, in your lifetime you may not you may or may not be given those much presentations the value i got from this program is 100 times 100 x and even if i if, even i paid even if i could pay 100 times more i would be satisfied so bishal uh, knows what he is doing and he has a very uh, clarity of the thought uh, and he knows what is needed for an each individual uh, so first thing is about the confidence i get the confidence in my speaking and the second one uh, monotonous speaking the delivering of message is not monotonous i i added variations because i got the right framework <clears throat> to present my skills and with that i am able to uh, connect to the people and deliver my message